Hello guys, welcome to you. In this video, we are going to see how to install HP Universal Printer Driver in Windows 10 operating system by the simplest way. HP Universal Printer Drivers support many old HP printers. That's why we are going to install it. So let's go. First of all, just go to the link given in the description. Okay, just go to that link. This is a website. Okay, just scroll down and here we find multiple links. First link is from the Mega and second is from the Google Drive link and first is the 64 bit links and second is the 30 bit link. Okay, and my machine is 64 bit. So I just go to the 64 bit link. If your machine is 32 bit, then just go to the 30 bit link. I'm going to the 64 bit link. Okay, I go to the Google Mega link. Okay, I click on the Mega link and Mega website is open in few seconds on our PC. Okay, now I just click on the download and download Mega link. Okay. It's a few minutes or few seconds depending on the speed of your internet. So be a patient and wait for a few seconds. Now our download is completed in few seconds. Okay. Now just click on the show all our download is completed. Click in a show in a folder. Drag this file to desktop. Okay. This file is a GIF file. Okay. And we are going to extract the GIF file or run the setup file. Okay. That is very easy. Just double click on this setup file or the, this file or just right click on it and just run as an administrator. Okay. I am going to the double click on this or the run as an administrator. Right click on it, run as an administrator. Click on the yes. Here we find two options. First is the unzip and second is the run winzip. You can click on any option. I am going to unzip and it is create a folder in a C drive in HP Universal Printer Drive. It's create a folder HP Universal Printer Drive in our C drive. Okay. I just click on the unzip and our in installation process is started in few seconds. Okay. Unzip is completed. Click on OK. Now just click on the yes. Here we find three options. First is the traditional mode and last option is USB mode plug and play. We are interested in these two options. You can use USB mode plug and play or traditional mode. I go to the traditional mode and just click on the next. Here just go with the last option add a local printer or network printer with manual settings select that and just click on the next. Most IMP part is port. Port is the most IMP part. Just go to the here and just select the port and if you find dot four underscore zero zero one HP printer device then select the HP printer device. If you not find HP device pr printer device then select any USB port USB 001, 002, 003, 004 just select any USB port that you like okay and just click on the next okay here we find two options HP Universal Printer PCL5 and second is the version 6.1.0 you can select any option that you like I select the last option and just click on the next button just add your printer name Okay, it is supporting lots of old printer. Okay, click on the next and it's take few seconds or a one minute. Okay, so wait for a few seconds or few minutes. Now our printer is installed. If you want to share this printer, then select this. And if you not want to share this printer on network, then just click do not share this printer. Select that and just click on the next. If you want to print a test page, then click on the printer test page or just click on the finish now our printer is installed in few seconds okay now our printer is installed just go to the here and just click on the finish and in devices and printers we find our hp laser jet p2055 printer is installed so guys this is the simplest way to install hp universal printer driver for our old printers okay so guys thank you for watching this video don't forget to like share comment on this video and don't forget to subscribe this channel thank you guys